Welcome back to Dreams in the Witch House on the Arcane Road. Let's recall what we were doing. Our next lecture is April 12th. Our exam is on the 21st. It is currently the 9th. Friday. I don't believe we have a di study date with Allison. We have been scratched. We are healing from that. We are tired. It's noon. Let's go ahead and work on our... On our theory. Yes, that's generally how essays work. Indeed. This is true. Fractals are fascinating things. We are very tired. But oh, we've got 6 out of 40. Oh, 5 out of 40. Mm. Well, let's go ahead and use our pain reliever. And then let's, um... Let's also go ahead and use some sleeping pills. And let's try and take some... Get some... Get some rest. I hope I turned out the lamp. What? Uh, yeah. What on earth? This is strange. I don't know if I like it either. To home we shall go. That was weird. Hmm. Well, at least we got our sanity back. We are peckish. And since we need more sanity gains, do we have the money for this? Yeah, we have plenty of money. Let's head over to the coffee house and have a meal. Because that will also help our sanity score. Alright, we've got all the rations we can get. I still have not found a need for the razor blades, so... How are our earplugs? They're fine. We're good on sleeping pills, we're good on pain reliever. I think we just need to go home. And, uh, do some work. Oh, Allison! Indeed! You wanna hang out? Indeed, spit it out, man. Huh, I just noticed that Allison has heterochroma. That's a condition where your eyes are two separate colors. It appears her right eye is green, but her blue rough eye is blue. Or perhaps it's just a trick of the pixel art. Reading is a good hobby. That is not boring at all. After all, if you don't know where you've been, it's hard to know where you're going. There's that too. Those who do read history, though, are doomed to watch those who don't read history repeat it, know what's coming, 
and not be able to do anything about it. I said what I said. I mean... I also am a big jazz fan. Mm. Jazz makes me think of New Orleans. I need to get back there. This was very nice. Now, let's actually try to get home, Walter. I mean, it's all fine and dandy that, you know, we went on a little impromptu date. Alright. Just wanted to double check that, you know. Alright. Let's see here. We're wet. But we're not soaked. So let's take some pain reliever. That was the pain reliever? Yes, yeah, good. Let's work on our theory a little more. I'm going to try and build up our sanity a little bit. What is a liniment? Wow. 13 out of 40. Not bad. We do need to study more math. Our sanity is still only 5-6. Wish it was higher. Well, let's study some math then. Take advantage of having this pain reliever. Our math score is still in 2.9, huh? And I guess we'll... It'll, the, the pain will interfere with our study, but... Lines of flux emanating from charged objects to visualize electric and magnetic fields. Yes, it, it typically would. Okay, let's turn out the lights. And I think it's time to get some sleep. Screw you noises. Hopefully we don't wake up wandering the city. Excellent. Whew, thank goodness. Have some rations. Sanity is slowly creeping back up towards six. <laughs> All right, um, we're only bruised now, so that's good. That means our studying won't be interfered with. We'll do some occult study. Excellent. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. I knew it. Son of a gun, I knew it. All right. Um, let's just get some sleep, Walter. Oh no, not this again. He's here this time. Let's, let's see if we can make some potions. Foxglove, Dijoxin, Lavender, Willow Bark. Uh, I think she has that over here.
Bat of Children, Fool's Gold, Mandrake, Willow Bark, Bat Guano, Lapis Nighter, Wolfsbane, Mummy Dust. Hmm. We have three Willow Bark. What is this? Witch's Oil, Potion for Restoration. Indeed. Let's before we before we demand to be let go. See if we can make any sense of this. Oh, hey, piece of wood. Can I use it on the rat? Oh, what about the old woman? What about this dude? Oh, dried herbs. I didn't notice these before. Lavender. So this is probably Foxglove. Okay. Oh, I didn't notice the shelf either. We don't need the shelf board right now. What's in here? Rain? Oh, that's possible. Cooking pot. Can't open it without a key, can we? No. Hmm. Except the worn out pillow. Don't mind me, viewers. I just want to take a very thorough look around here. Walter doesn't want to touch the books. I believe we've covered that. And then there's the book that she wants us to read from. I really don't want to read from that. Let's demand to be released. Yeah, I don't want you to cost me any more sanity. Yeah, the wizard's hut is right there. Sleep. Oh no, we're not tired. Great. But there's nothing we can do because our light bulb is burned out. Let's just rest then. Okay, well... That almost healed us completely. Amazing. We are a little peckish. It is Monday. Let's grab the newspaper. So wet and rainy. Oh no, ew. Me too. Free health checkup at the Arkham Regional Health Center. Alright, we'll have to do that. Aunt Margaret? Twelve dollars. Very good.
that's probably, yeah, not until evening. Let's go to the university. And we will attend our lecture. Oh, hey, Elwood. What's up, buddy? Yes. <laughs> we made some wild arguments, did I? Alright, so he's not much for occult stuff. Things are going fine, just fine. Let's go to our lecture. Faraday Disc was the world's first electric generator. That's kind of cool. Um, fun fact, I believe the Royal... Is that the Royal Archives? Or the... Royal Society? Royal Academy? Um, one of those things over in England, every year they do a... Um, purely out of habit, I came here. Oh, there is a study desk. And it's only noon. Anyway, um... They have... A lecture, they call it the Faraday Lecture, where they actually have Michael Faraday's desk. It's so cool. Um... And they do one of these things every year. It's televised on the BBC, I believe. Um, and you can find them on YouTube. It's They're fun to watch. Um, and it's always on, you know, chemistry or, you know, physics or something. Michael Faraday is a personal hero of mine, okay? I'll admit it. This is true. Um... I actually, in college, was able to see a group of Tibetan monks making a sand mandala uh, and then saw them uh, ritualistically destroy it at the end of their visit. Uh, it was a gorgeous piece of work. I mean, just stunning detail, color. It was just beautiful. Um, and then they just ran their hands through it and completely destroyed it. Um, I believe I still have a little pouch of the sand somewhere around my house. Uh, so that's kind of cool. Don't really need the pain reliever limit anymore. Do we still have... No. No, we apparently only have those in our dream. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's go to the city event. Uh, we were given painkillers for our injuries. We've been advised to rest and relax. What can you do for me? You can give me some rations, my dude. And then we need to hit the pharmacy. Can I purchase? No. Oh, I could purchase more sleeping pills. That's good. Does that, like, give us two bottles, or does that... Oh, no, it just charges up our bottle. Nice. Okay. All right, all right. That's neat. I wish we could buy more earplugs. Let's stop by Dombrowski's room. Tell her about our light bulb. Broken light bulb. Yeah, that's all. You grouch. Sleeping pills. Oh, we should have turned in that. That's why I wanted to go to the library. Is 
Sif, please get a good night's rest. Please, good night's rest. Oh, excellent. Excellent. We're slowly clawing back our sanity. Walter's about to complain that he's hungry. Can't study because it's too dark. Uh, I guess just rest four hours. Okay. Excellent. All right, let's let's go get new earplugs. Breaking news. Yeah, see, I'm interested. Let's buy a newspaper. You have your rain gear on? Get your newspaper! Purchase. Earplugs. Let's buy some more pain reliever. Just in case we need it. Alright, let's head to the university. We could turn in this book. That's something we definitely need to do. <laughs> we'll return that. Let's grab another occult text. Maybe Cosmogenesis. Because we read this Daemon Alatria, the De Occulta Philosophia Libri. Maybe maybe we'll grab the Malaeus Maleficarum. Yeah, let's grab the Malaeus Maleficarum. Because we're dealing with a witch. Heinrich Kramer. Collection 2. Wonders of the Invisible World. Right, this is organized by author, isn't it? It's going to be up top. Yep. Okay, okay. There we go, we found our book with our government approved pixel. Okay, let's go check that out. Thank you, lady. Let's study a little bit for our next exam. After all, we want to maintain getting our Good grades. Yes, moving charges do create magnetic fields. That's how electromagnets work. Faraday Cage is an enclosure designed to exclude electromagnetic fields. Having worked in one before, they are freaky to be inside for a long period of time. Like, I don't know what it was, but... I spent like an hour working in one and afterwards I was I was feeling a bit like I was having trouble focusing like I wasn't lucid all right let's work on our theory a little bit oh or not because we can't and I suppose I suppose just go home well let's Maybe we could check out the island. Maybe there's something different there this time. Shoot. Those guys are still here. 
We'll have to come back during the day, I guess. Don't want to get too wet. We'll head home. So that that witch can show up and torture us some more. Let's have a little bit of a luxury. I'm sorry. No. No. No baby crying. No. Bad. Light the fire. Elwood, can we stay in your room for the night? Alright. We're hungry. That's fine. We can deal with hungry. No. No, we have plenty of money. Let's go to the coffee house. And let's have a meal. Oh, we never read yesterday's paper. Silly rogue. I'll go ahead and buy a paper again. Let's just waste another dollar. Oh. Oh. Oh my. We'll go to the university, I guess. Let's talk to this kid, I guess. Know anything about the missing kid? Poster for the missing child. Two years, blonde hair, white pajamas. Sawdust. What's in the barrel? Listen, Walter, you're in a point-and-click adventure game, okay? Alright, buddy. We're gonna be checking things out. That doesn't start until evening. Let's go to the university and perhaps do some studying. If we run into Allison, maybe we can invite her to the theater. Possibly. Yes, they are. Let's go to the, the, the show. Just a humdrum comedy. Ooh, that was a really good bonus to our sanity there. We're actually doing pretty good. Okay, let's head home. Let's go see Dombrowski, see if she has our, our new, uh, light bulb also why was there a baby crying
Yeah. I don't like it either. Yeah. It was definitely a baby crying. No children, no breeding, no. Mmm. <laughs> I wasn't done. Rude. Got my light bulb? Thank you. The rain finally stopped. That's nice. Let's change our light bulb. Oh, good. The rat hole cover is still in place. Although we get treated to the sounds of ridiculousness. Walter, I really wish you would share with us what you're reading. Electromagnetic induction is the production of an electromotive force across an electrical conductor in a magnetic field. That is the basic principle behind a generator. Oh, it's cold. Turn off that light. We studied all night. Pretty tired. We're pretty hungry. Running a little low on funds. Well, let's just have some rations. And, uh, we'll work on our theory a little bit, and then we'll go to sleep for a little while. That's okay, Walter. We should be okay. I wish we had access to, like, a weather forecast. But will Walter be able to sleep? Find out next time on Let's Play Dreams in the Witch House. I'm the Arcane Rogue, and as always, I hope you have a wonderful day. Safeguard your sanity, folks. <laughs>